State starters outscored North Florida starters 51 to 8, led by Ivy Slaughter's career high 19 points, as the Seminoles shrugged off some post final thrust to win 61 to 42. I could tell that it was uh, eight days since we'd played. Uh, I thought we were extremely rusty in some areas, and uh, you know, but I, I did like the the effort that I saw, even though things weren't going our way, I thought we had great effort, uh, you know, from a lot of individuals, and, and that's always really important. Every game is a key point to try to get offensive rebounds and second chance points. So, I mean, this game was the same: try to get second chance points, crash the boards, and I think we kind of did that. They were so worried about us. We scored 20 plus points in the paint. I know we scored more in the paint. And they tried to crash, like, clog the paint, and we got the shooters open, and they knocked down shots. You know, it wasn't as nerve-wracking as I thought it would be. <laughs> <laughs> um, I felt calm. I felt like I hadn't, you know, missed a whole year or, or sat out a whole year, so it was really good to get out there and finally be a part of the team. Now, you know, one of the things that goes along with not playing in eight days is we've got some new rotations to look at with Amaya. And I think that there's a lot of good film that we're going to be able to watch with her uh, and help her to really understand and grow in some areas. I thought, you know, her effort was tremendous. For the first time being out there, I, I didn't think she missed a beat. Now we've got to really go back and, and work because we've got two great teams, three great teams that uh, will face two of the three when we go out to California. The Seminoles now head out west to California to take on Pacific on Thursday for the Long Beach Tournament. That game is at 10 o'clock Eastern Time. Yeah. That'll wrap up the